It's Ash from Super Videos back for another video for season 10 of The Walking Dead. In this video, we're going to look at the image that was recently released by Entertainment Weekly. It's our first look at season 10 of The Walking Dead. So in this video, I'm going to be looking at the photo that was released and talking about it, as well as reading the article that Entertainment Weekly has on top of the image that was released to see if we can gather any information or clues from that. So the title of the Entertainment Weekly article reads, See Michonne in a fiery first image from The Walking Dead Season 10. And we have our first look at Michonne in Season 10 here. It's a pretty cool and epic shot of Michonne. She's obviously using her katana to kill a bunch of walkers. And we see that she's already killed a bunch more around. We can see the leg of one walker here. Now I love the atmosphere that we have the fire the smoke i think that adds a lot to this shot and it makes it more interesting but let's go through the article and see what they have to say so the article reads if season 10 of the walking dead is indeed to be the niagara's last as ew and others have reported it looks like her character of michonne is ready to go out in a blaze of glory so of course they want you to think that she's going to die or they are in a way clickbaiting it because they want you to think that she's gonna die but obviously we know that it's a very very unlikely she's gonna die and the most likelihood scenario is that she's going to leave the tv show and join or reunite with rick in the movies so she's gonna leave just like rick did but obviously like it says here they want you to think that she's going to go out in a blaze of glory, which means that she's going to sacrifice herself and basically die that way. But again, I don't think that's going to happen. We've got the exclusive first image from season 10, and it shows the warrior mowing down zombies while a fire rages in the background. Obviously, it looks super badass, but what is significant of the image? For that, we went to showrunner Angela Kang for answers. Now, before I even read what Angela Kang said... I do think that it's an interesting first image to release. From all the things they could have given us as the first look at season 10, this is what they gave us. So the fact that it's Michonne kind of makes sense because it's going to be Michonne's last season. But why this particular shot of Michonne? That's what I really want to know. It could be nothing. There could be no reason behind it. But I wonder if Angela Kang actually brings up anything about that. So Angela Kang answers, one of the things that we have going on this season is we're continuing some exploration of natural elements and how they play into our world, says Kang. And fire is one of those elements that comes into play in a few ways that twist the story in a way that will be pretty exciting. So one thing I do want to mention, of course, when she says natural elements, she is referring to the snow as well that we saw last season. So they explored natural elements last season in that way. This season, it could be fire. It could be more. Oh, also last season, they did the storm as well with the introduction of the whispers. They incorporated that into the story. But it's interesting that she says they're going to use fire in a few ways or a few key ways that twist the story. So that's very, very interesting. As Kang notes, fire is dangerous enough in our world, but in a landscape with such limited resources, it's another matter altogether. Fire is terrifying now, says Kang, but we sort of take for granted that we have people that can deal with it. It obviously has very different implications for our people in an apocalyptic world. So it seems like more and more both The Walking Dead and Fear the Walking Dead are moving towards that kind of natural element or that other event other than the walkers. Of course, in The Walking Dead, we've had snow, the storm and things like that. And they're introducing how fire can be incorporated and how it might play out in a post-apocalyptic world in The Walking Dead. But in Fear the Walking Dead, they did a lot with I think fire as well if I remember right but also this season of fear season five they have been playing around a lot with just radiation being a factor and contaminated walkers and things like that so I think in both mediums they are incorporating that natural element or that otherworldly event other than the walkers themselves that are going to make the world a little bit more interesting and the story is a little bit more interesting and different continuing on the article it reads what else can the showrunner who has already told ew about the themes that will be covered in season 10 as well as a new comic character of course that's referring to dante now for a long time a lot of fans were thinking that 
the ex Xavier who had that connection with Maggie went into a relationship with Enid. What was his name? That ex Xavier. You all know who I'm talking about. So a lot of fans were thinking that he was Dante, but this pretty much officially confirms that that wasn't Dante and Dante and him were separate characters. So they're asking Angela Kang, what can you tease about what we see in this photo? And she replies, I don't want to give too much away about this particular story because hopefully there's some unexpected aspects to it, says Kang. But we will definitely see our people trying to contend with things that they can't handle in the same ways that we do in our world. So obviously she's referring to the fire now again and the fact that in that post-apocalyptic world they don't have the resources they don't have firefighters to fight the fires so that's pretty interesting the article ends with we'll have a new piece of walking that scoop every day leading up to the show's comic-con panel in san diego on july 19th so that's this friday very excited for that i'm going to be breaking everything down and reacting to everything that's going to be released from the trailers of the walking dead season 10 to the trailer of the second half of fear the walking dead to anything that we might get for the rick movies but that's basically everything that i wanted to talk about in this video that's it for this video see you next time for another super video if you like what you see press like subscribe for more content and press the bell button to receive notifications for daily uploads